finally, we're ready to put something into Illustrator, to put our text in. Let me give you a little pro tip here. Open up a new tab. Why don't you set a bookmark right here? Add a shortcut to the Mac Lab. Easy way to get back to the class. Make sure it's just maclab.gameful.me. No pound sign, no slash, anything. Just maclab.gameful.me. And then click on Dream Yet Complete right here. See that? Dream Yet Complete. Click on that. We're just going to take the first stanza. Hey, look. Typography. Hmm. And the pen tool. And a mock-up. Oh, my goodness. Things we're all going to learn. We're going to just take these first six sentences and then Command C. Copy it. Okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can right-click and copy it. But why not learn? Command C after you highlight it. Then we can go back to Illustrator and click on the type tool and sometimes mine will stall a little bit. I have so many fonts. Uh, don't change anything. Just notice that this changed, this changed, and just click. Click and it's little dinky text and then hit Command V for vomit, right? Ugh. And then click on the selection tool, the direct selection tool right there, the black arrow at the top, and that highlights that. And then come up here to the size of the font and come down and look at it. And just say, okay, 48. That's a good starting point for where we are. Now, I'm going to show you how to change fonts and how to how to look through and do all that, but for right now, we'll just stick with this just to keep things simple. But there's one thing missing. There's no attribution. We always want to give credit to the author, and it's not like I want credit for this, but it's just to help you learn some new things.